The most famous spy in the world celebrates 50 years on the big screen with the latest 007 adventure, Skyfall. Daniel Craig once again stars as Bond, James Bond, this time on a mission that's more personal. Bond is back. Daniel Craig wears 007's tuxedo for a third time in the latest James Bond action thriller, Skyfall. I'm really lucky to have landed this role and I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, I'm really feel very passionately about it. Judy Dench also returns as Bond's boss, M. Take the shot. Take the bloody shot. This time out, Bond has to protect M from her past. The veteran actress enjoyed her expanded storyline. After each one, you never know quite what's coming up next. Um, so it was a great surprise, this one. You caught me. Javier Bardem joins the ranks of classic Bond villains, playing a former agent who becomes a cyber terrorist. <laughs> I like that idea that it's, it's a human being behind the Bond villain figure. There's a person who wants to achieve something very personal. It's been 50 years since James Bond first hit the big screen. The cast has a few theories as to why the character remains popular. They've always made movies to appeal and to, to entertain and to keep packing people in. He always wears wonderful suits. He always has gloriously witty lines, beautiful women. Skyfall is the 23rd Bond film, and the franchise shows no signs of slowing down. Alexis Christophorus, CBS News, New York. Skyfall comes out in theaters nationwide on Friday, but you can watch a special for your eyes only viewing in Lansing today. I donned my tux as 00 Evan this morning to host the Celebration Cinema Skyfall I. Max premiere. More than 100 people filled up the theater for the early viewing, many even sporting similar 00 styled ensembles. Everyone who sees the movie today can also get their gold fingers on a piece of 007 memorabilia, a classic Skyfall poster of Daniel Craig.